Take the guesswork out of your life. Have you ever felt like you had no idea what to do or what direction to go? Have you spent hours trying to figure out what your purpose is? Look no further. We at Partum have a solution that identifies who you are, what you're supposed to do, and how you can achieve it through easy and simple steps. There's no more guessing, no more feeling lost. You can now get back on track and get the wealth in your life you deserve. Whether you're a business owner, entrepreneur, millennial, we can help. Visit Partem.me, that's Partem.me, to get get started right now. Being married to an entrepreneur is hard work, but it's worth it when it works. You got your hands full every day like I do. You got kids, you got a, you know, a marriage that you're trying to work, you're tr- a business that you're trying to make work and finding time for the kids and keeping it spontaneous. But I was good last night. Oh, <laughs> Nobody teaches you how to manage a business or manage a relationship or marriage. Everybody's just trying to do the best that they can. The purpose of the show is to give you some tools on how to make the marriage and the business work. We don't do it perfect, but we're figuring it out. Hello, welcome to the G&E Show every Wednesday, noon Eastern Standard Time. Handsome hubby Grant Cardone and I are bringing it to you. And defender of the empire, Elena Cardone, great wife that she is. Extraordinary. You guys and gals ever get a spouse as good (laughs) as this one right here. I'm telling you, you you scored big time. Thank you. You hit the gold mine. Thank you. You pulled out the nuggets, the bouillon, the Bitcoin. Well, I'll tell you something, since you gave me that props, you're every bit of a man worthy of everything I do for you and for us. So lay come it on, up there. Come, come on, on, come on. You know come we're on. square. Come on, we are square. Okay, so today... Appreciate you joining. Thank you so much for joining. By the way, if you haven't subscribed to Grant Cardone TV and that's where you're watching, make sure you subscribe and comment there. If you're on YouTube and you had not subscribed, please do that. Uh, also, we want to hear what you think about our show. Post in comments. Elaine and myself read the comments afterwards, and we'll do our best to respond to you. So, really appreciate you joining love today. Love our comments. I love uh, today the and every today. Wednesday at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, we come to you to talk about the business of marriage. Yes, we do. And the business of building your empire. Just imagine if you could build your empire. By the way, you are an ant. You know, an ant hill is an empire. Yeah, for sure. Until I put Big Red Foot, until Big Red Foot. There's some nice stuff. What do y'all think about my new shoes, man? These are some major kids. If you dig the shoes, man, if you dig the shoes, comment. You know what? I was trying to decide, too. My gut said no, and then I said, wait, let me give them a chance because I've never seen anything like them. If anyone can pull off the so funk, defy, it's you. Ferragamo. So I like them. I gave them a check. I like the red in the back. Dude, they're sick, right? Let them percolate. They grow on you. So, anyway. so if you don't like the shoes, post, please uh, comment. I'd love to hear that. If you do like them, I'd like to hear that. Somebody said, man, you're getting them just because they got high heels on them. I said, I never even considered that, okay? But whatever, okay? All right, so today we're talking about, Elena, something yeah. happened this week. Yes. Something happened and this Something week. happened this week, and, and, and I mean, something's always happening. Yeah, I course. was in Houston, Texas. I was out. Me and Captain Ryan shopped in the last two days. We did... Three meetings, no, no, six meetings, three meetings with uh, clients, three more meetings with uh, real estate agents, yeah. brokers, yeah. and looked at 4,800 units, Ooh, I was 16 so properties. Too. I we I were in Sugarland, Bel Air, uh, mm-hmm. uh, Galleria area, uh, Pasadena Arier. Heights uh-huh. area, <laughs> Offer. Okay. Whatever, man, whatever, whatever, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so Y'all let's, make let's fun get into the show. So wrap but up anyway, what you anyway, to say. I ran into this dude. Oh, and this go guy, there. this guy, this okay, guy, wow. this guy made a claim about me, and I said, hey, knock that off, son. Stop it. Don't do that. That's not okay. Quit acting like a victim. Quit lying. What you're saying's not true. And he started running his mouth. Shut up. Sit down and listen to me, son. Ooh, listen to me. Or get up sun? and walk away. Okay? Oh One of the two. Stop it. Knock it out. Now, Captain Ryan was there. Captain Ryan couldn't believe it. I'm like, hey, he starts saying that. Blah, blah, blah. I mean, shut up. Stop it. Knock it off. Stop the That's madness. That's not true. Okay? And I'm like, look, I'm talking to you, man. I'm talking to you. You're not going to talk. I'm going to talk. 
Okay, I don't want to hear your lies. I don't want to hear your psycho babble bullshit. Stop it. Knock it off. Now, the point of that is this. I told Elaine about this. She's like, oh, my God, I couldn't believe it. And by the way, don't email my wife, son, ever. No. Now, what we're talking about today is defending the people you love, man. Okay? I am willing to fight for the people I love. I don't have your back. I got your front. Okay? I'm not behind you, man. I'm in front. Okay? You guys got to defend what you want. You don't, you don't do it from the back. You do it from the front. You That's can't stand back here and like, oh, I'll, I'll be there for you, Graham, if something happens. Dude, I'm going to look back. You're still back there. Mm -hmm. I need you up front. Mm -hmm. Okay? We want you to call in 305-865-8668. We're talking about defending the ones you love. Defending the people you do business with. Defending your friends at your own peril. Okay, and how do you do that? You know, I mean, I, I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to do what I always do. I'm going to decide who's on my team. Who's on my team? That's who I fight for. Everybody else, they're not on my team. Dude, I ain't fighting for them, right? Who's on my team? Who do I trust? I had a buddy uh, about two months ago, a guy I do a lot of business with. He's a good friend of mine. He gets a phone call from a guy that says, Cardone said that you're charging him X. Well, the guy called me up and said, Grant, did you say this? I said, no, let me ask you a question. What did you say when he said that to you? You should know. You should have said he would never say that. Mm -hmm. My buddy G would never say that. Grant's been my partner for seven years. He would never tell you that. So the point of that is this. And by the way, my buddy B, BL, he didn't know that for sure, but he needs to know that. He needs to know Grant wouldn't say that. If Elena gets a phone call from one of her girlfriends, your husband's cheating on someone else. Her response should be what? Cheat. Who's on my side? Would he do that? Commit to the guy I sleep with. She would say, what? I, w I mean, I, I, would, I would never even get that call. But I mean, if but I did, I would shut it down. You I mean, shut I it would down, do due diligence behind the later, scenes. Later, later. You shut that her, freaking party no. down. Yeah. You shut that party down. My name's Grant Cardone. This is Elena Ooh, Cardone. You're watching the G&E like show. Today, we're talking about defending the ones you love. Ooh, Fighting for the hot, ones you love. Hot. Building your empire and protecting it at all costs. How to squash those rumors. Don't go anywhere. Woo! Opportunity, it's what we live for. Financial freedom is created from opportunity. At Symmetry Financial, we are committed to getting hard workers, talented individuals who love to sell, who love to help others create a strong six-figure income. If you ever wanted to have everything you wanted in life, Symmetry Financial holds the key to get you there. We want you, the top talent, the best in the business to join our team. Sign up now at sfgcareers.biz. That's sfgcareers.biz. Leave a mark in your neighborhood with a lasting impression. A professional landscape can deliver that and more. And the man to bring it to you is Steve Griggs. Awarded the national best of hows in client satisfaction in 2016 with clients such as Dr. Oz and the Palisade Center Mall in West Nyack. Steve Griggs crafts and delivers a brilliant landscape plan guaranteeing your backyard oasis at a fair price. This isn't landscape design, this is lifestyle design. For more information, visit stevegriggsdesign.com. That's stevegriggsdesign.com. Create the ideal tropical island experience you have been waiting for with our premium palapas. Design and build the backyard, hotel, or lounge space you desire with Paradise Palapas. The eye of the Caribbean and the most tropical places brought right to you. Whether you are just seeking escape from the sun, poolside, or wanting to transform your backyard deck into the dream outdoor kitchen, Paradise Palapas will build it for you. Don't dream it, live it. Visit paradisepalapas.com, that's paradisepalapas.com, and we'll get you set up today. Hey, welcome back to the GE Show. We're back. David's here. David's our guest here in the room tonight. We got Robin, we got John, we got Robert Cislo, the video genius, super marketing genius of the universe, the Cisco kid <laughs> and video genius. Today, Elena, yes. every Wednesday we yes. come talk about yes. what? Business of what? The business of marriage. Yeah, I've been so happy with you, by the way. I, I came home I from the road. It's so good to see you and the kids. Me too. And miss you he guys. He comes home from the road and he's like, baby, I got a present for you. 35 pounds of crawfish. I was like, woohoo! And he's like, now peel them all. I and was they, like, and they, and, they, and they weren't any good either, man. Yeah, they what weren't the heck? Any good. I they, see they, where they this is good. going. Okay, so today we're talking about defending yourself. We'd love to get your calls, love to get your input. Have you ever had to defend somebody you loved? Have you ever got misinformation from somebody before? These are my tips for defending. 
Well, you the know, and a, you and a lot of kids have this situation in, in schools, you know, like so-and-so went so far with so-and-so, you know, and these are real, Jesus. <laughs> I'm just saying, it's a perfect, perfect show to be talking this, about how to defend the yeah, ones you I love, know. okay? I got a swap okay? pen today. Okay, right here, buddy, right here, okay? From I just Fernando. Happen to, I happen to keep this in my pocket, okay, just like this. <laughs> so look, we're talking about, are you Please, willing to throw down scary. for the people you love? Are you willing to throw down for the people you love? I am. I tell you what, man, I've been you in are. enough fights where I had to defend myself. Today, I will defend my partners, my friends, my church, my wife, my kids. Well, I've never look, been I might in not a beat you. I might not beat you, but I life. guarantee you're going to leave this. You're going to leave it. We don't know who's going to win. Both of us are going to walk away all mangled. Okay, I'll walk away Hopefully. with my damn self-respect and say, I went away. down fighting, man. I don't want to go down like a coward. All right. So number one, <laughs> decide whose team you on, man. Who's on your team? Yeah. Because it isn't 50 people. And here's the thing. When you decide who's on your team, pick people who are honorable, admirable, who have courage, who are going to protect you too, and who are ethical. People you don't have to worry about, well, did they really do the such and such thing? You know and, what I'm and, saying? And look, like, people can screw up. Yeah, that's true. But look, when somebody comes to me and says, Jerry did something, no, he didn't. No, he didn't do that, dude. Don't even tell me that. Stop it right there. Stop it. Now, I'm going to go check with Jared. Hey, Jared. What happened? Hey, this dude said blah, but I'm not going to trust you over Jared. All right? That's true. Number because, one. Because Number two. Because your, your friends, the people I know who my talking friends are. to you are either your friends or your enemy. If, if you they're confused know. about other people, they're your enemy. Yeah, and if you don't know if they're your friend or your enemy, they're the enemy, man. There's no in-between on this stuff. You guys got to get out of the gray. Well, maybe they're just trying to help me. Dude, most of these people are freaking can't help themselves. They're just dropping rumors and gossip and they're reading bullshit magazines and getting their data from CNN and people that are confused on the freaking networks. Look, we know it's fake news. You know it's fake news, right? It's propaganda news. Okay, All number two, it. commit no what side you're to on. defending the people on your team, man. Commit to defending them, right? Number three, defend at all costs. And shut it down. That's why this guy told me this weekend, blah, blah, so and so, blah, blah. Dude, stop it. Knock it off. Just shut it down. Shut it down. End the madness. My buddy Ryan Seco says, stop, stop the, the madness. madness. Shut it down. STM. Okay. STM. And number four, the other person is either on your side or they're on the other side. That's it, man. There's not two teams here. You got to decide who your army is. And it doesn't need to be a thousand people, but it needs to be four or five strong. This guy told me, he's like, this is going to be like David and Goliath. I said, dude, you know, I ain't David or Goliath. I'm freaking nutsoid, bro. Okay. I'm going to go freaking spazzo on you. You understand? I am willing to lose everything over this one thing. I'm going to fight to the end, whether it's a deal I'm in, buying a deal, getting a deal. Elena can tell you a story about a lawsuit I was in about 10 or 12 years ago. It was a freaking huge, massive lawsuit. I was bleeding out 200 grand a month on legal fees, and the lawyer just kept saying, settle, man, settle my side, right? You yeah. saw what happened. Yeah. Yeah. I said, dude, we ain't settling, dog. Okay, I'm going down. He said. We going down, okay? And you know what happened? When, with my commitment came creativity, and I went to them, and I made a deal. And I said, I got a way to solve the problem. Neither lawyer, neither side could come up with this deal but me, okay? Because I was willing to go down with the ship. Let's take a caller, huh? Okay, what do you say? let's do it, yeah. What's up, Frankie? My sister called the other day and says, I heard, dude, stop it. Knock off the madness. You heard that from somebody you don't even know who they is. Okay, go ahead. What's up? How you doing, Mr. Cardell? Man, I'm doing good, bro. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling revived. I'm feeling jacked. That's awesome. Man, it's so, it's so good to speak with you. I can't believe I got through. It's a pleasure and honor to speak with you. And uh, I just have to say, first and foremost, thank you um, for your motivation, your inspiration, been following you on all your social media and YouTube. And uh, I love everything you're saying, and I'm buying into what you're saying. Dude, I appreciate you, man. Thank you so much for calling in. What's going on? What, 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 what do you want to say to me? I just, you wanted to talk about defending your family. Yeah. And, uh, you know, I've had to defend my wife, which at the time was my girlfriend. And, uh, and I, I even spent some jail time, but it was worth it, 100%. But Sometimes I, you got to go to jail, man. 
it, you know, at that time, it it, uh, it just ha- it had to be the route at that time. But I'll tell you, I defended them and and made sure I have my home protected. But the one thing I failed to do is defend them from a financial standpoint. Wow. Oh, man, wow. I broke my pen on that statement. Dude, that's big, man. <laughs> I, I got so full that's of big. anxiety. That's big, man. That's a big realization right there. I, that's that's what I failed in, and that, that that's changing. It's already started to change. I'm getting my mind right, get my priorities straight. Yeah, what do you I'm do for work? To take care of them. What do you do for work? Um, I'm, a, I'm a manager at a medical device company. Okay. Well, anything me and Elena can do to, to help you, man, defend them financially, we're here, we're here for you, all right? Millionaire booklet. Yeah, have you gotten this yet? Have you gotten this? The, uh, I've got the, uh, I just got your millionaire booklet. I've been following your videos, and, oh. and I've been doing the millionaire math. Oh, good, good, good. So any of you that want the millionaire booklet, if you go to millionairebooklet.com forward slash free, millionairebooklet.com forward slash free, we'll give you that book today. Just take care of the shipping, all right? Another call, baby. You want to say something? No, you haven't been go. talking much. Tell me, have you ever had to? Have you ever had somebody come tell you something about me that wasn't like that caused a little doubt or anything, or somebody else? Well, maybe? it was in the beginning when we were first, like you know, kind of hooking up. Do you remember? Yeah, and, remember and, and I had people? like everyone out of the woodwork telling me, like you know, that you're a shark. That you're a player. He was a loser. That, he, she was a loser. Um, I mean, I heard really heinous things. She wanted to be with me. Yeah, she did. And she did. so, you know, I mean, and she in the beginning, to get in the I, candy was, store. I, I was She wanted time. to get into the 10X candy store when she couldn't. So what did she tell Elena? He's a player. Yeah, but I didn't play with you, bitch. Ooh. Huh? Tad out. How you like me now? Boom, man. You guys got to be able to defend from the front, man. Know where you stand. My name's Grant Cardone. There's Elena Cardone, the beautiful Elena Cardone on Instagram. <laughs> Stay with us. Want to learn how to invest in real estate like Grant Cardone, but you don't have the cash to invest yet? Reach out to Chris Root and his team where he will show you how to invest in real estate to build cash without credit or much money by learning how to wholesale real estate. We'll show you the right way to build cash so you can invest in multifamily apartments and other real estate investments like Grant Cardone. Sign up now at chrisrood.com. That's chrisrood.com. Get your marketing and copyright the first time and save your company from a $60,000, $70,000, $100,000 mistake because you can utilize what you have already, generate leads, and make more money. You have to simplify the process and keep it simple. And that's what we do at Pixel 506. We will outthink your competition, create the fastest, most effective marketing and web design, and grow your business with leads and effective top-notch marketing strategies. Turn that $60,000, $100,000 mistake into a million-dollar profit. Sign up now at pixel506.com. There's only one company you need to know in telecommunications, and that's Bullfrog. Bullfrog is so advanced and so in the future, you don't even need a desk phone anymore to run a business. Integrate right now with what you and your employees already pay for, their cell phone. Run an entire business from there, from group chat to monitoring to call forwarding, and we will guarantee that you never experience a drop call again. You can save an extra $60,000 a year with Bullfrog and the plans that they have for your company. And for your free trial, go to bullfrog.net. That's bullfrog.net. Dot net for your free trial of this outstanding service. Go to bullfrog.net for your free trial right now. And we're hey, back. welcome back. Welcome back. back. Elena Cardone. Oh, yeah. The GD Show, baby. Guys. We got a lot of callers, folks. We're I talking mean, about how to defend the ones you love. Mm-hmm. Want to know what you think. How are you going to do it? 305-865-8668. Let's take a caller. Let's see what they're doing to defend the ones they love. Okay, I've got Bruce from California. What's up, Bruce? Bruce. Uh oh. Okay, we don't have that. He's okay. busy. Fernando from Arizona. Fernando, what's going on? Grant, what's up, brother? What's going <laughs> on, Palaya? Hey, I know you remember me, man. You know I do. Oh yep. Hey, I wanna let you know that you I know you mentioned about public speaking, but I'm just gonna jump into multifamily homes like you. Okay. I like this. Oh, idea. Yeah, let's jump. Right now, I was going to ask you, I'm in Tucson, obviously, in Arizona, and I was wondering, I'm only nice, like, you said not to bring up my age, so I'm not even going to bring up my age. Yeah, good. So That's good, man, because I'm kind of bored with people's age. mention the 19 thing. Go on. Yeah, so what I wanted to mention is, what's the best way to get started for me right now? 
It started with what? With the real estate venture. The multifamily. Save some money, uh, yeah. pack it away. Yeah, you need it. You need, you and need start money. looking. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Take it over. I you see need, how, what happens when you, I hang you, out with you. Well, yeah, you, you need money, dude. Well, how, about how much? Lots. A lot? Yeah, yeah. You Look, you need money or you need knowledge. One of the two. Or you need the willingness yeah. to sweat. So, so either way, you're going to need money. money. You're going to need money, you're going to need product, and you're going to need knowledge. So if you don't have the money, find a guy like me that's got some money. But okay. I don't have the time. So you're going to need the product. Then you're going to be like, I found a deal, Grant. I found a deal. I got a deal. Okay, well, you got to be sure that deal gets my attention. Like a lot of deals that I see, they're just they're, they're either too small or they're not in the space I want. I don't want a hotel. So I got a guy <laughs> sends me a, a land deal the other day. I don't, I don't want land, okay? There's a certain thing I want. So then you got to find the money. That's going to be an investor. Or you're going to get the money. Or the, you're going to provide the sweat. That means you got to have the intelligence. You got to have the product. So uh, how do you get started? Same way I did when I was 20, 29 years old, man. You know, I started shopping property every weekend. I had no clue what I was doing. Look, look, everything that I've done today, I didn't know at one time. So just so everybody knows, I, I was never married, but yeah, I married her. I didn't know how to do that. We had kids. I didn't know how to do that. Nope, I wrote a either. book. I didn't know how to do that. I wrote a book in two hours. I didn't know how to do that. We did the 10X growth conference. I didn't know how to do that. Okay. We're going to do another one. By the way, if you want a free ticket, free tickets today, we give giving free tickets out. 10xgrowthcon.com. Just go to 10xgrowthcon.com. I give you a damn ticket. Okay. Uh, uh, what else have I done? I, I started my first business. I didn't know what I was doing. I bought my first apartment building. I didn't know what I was doing. I got my first loan. I didn't know what I was doing. Uh, what are you uh, about getting loans name? I bought a plane. I didn't know what I was doing. I didn't even know what to look at. I got this gift from Fernando the Savage. The Savage Tycoon on Instagram. Go to Savage Tycoon. I, I didn't know how to put com. it together. I didn't know that was a battery. I didn't know. I didn't know. I don't. You just so figure what? it out. Is that the point? To all yeah, that? and your you age don't it matter, bro. Because Jesus, just figure it Jesus, out. Jesus was resurrected this past weekend. He was only thirty-three. Okay. But he probably knew. I'm sure he knew what huh? he was doing. He knew what he was doing because he knows everything. Dude, he didn't know about Zappos, though. He didn't know about Zappos, but he, he knows would have, now. He had more than one pair of shoes. Oh, Lord have Every mercy. Every picture I see of that dude, man, same pair of sandals. I'm like, man, come on, man. How about some Uggs, baby? How about Ain't some of those? Ain't you got some Uggs up there, man? Look. Come on, man. How about some of these, dog? Come on, Jay. Jay, Jay, come on, man. How about, how about get a little red in your freaking, uh, in your, in your, in your, in your, in your, in your what? What is this called when I got clothes? Swag in wow. your so gear and your attire and yeah, your wardrobe and your little color in your wardrobe, okay. Jay. <laughs> Come on, man. All right, let's take the next color. See, see, now you guys, you guys, by the way, you guys, when you're going to defend your somebody, you're, you, the people on your team, who's on your team? Just because they're your mom or your dad, your uncle, your aunt, doesn't mean they're on your team. It means you're in their family. Okay? Like, like, like everybody's got different stuff going on. You know, like just because your sister's your sister doesn't mean she's on your team. How do you know if they're on your team? They ought to be buying your products. Oh, right. I'm getting a call after this one. I guarantee you. What? Your mama invests with me. Yeah, she My does. sister invests yeah. with me. My twin brother invests with me. Yeah. They believe in me. Yeah, that's true. Look, Good. I'm th glad th you're clarifying. That's not behind me. That's with me. You understand? I call my twin brother up. I'm like, hey, I'm coming out with my new new book, Be Obsessed or Be Out. How many you want me to buy? Dude, he's on my team. You my understand? mom bought 30 of your books and gave them to the college and the high school. That's what I mean, man. Who's on your team? You guys are in network marketing. You can't even get your uncle to be, be your uncle won't even buy a freaking drink. Mm. He ain't on your team, man. He's your uncle. Right? He, he's not even on his own team. Like, man, don't you understand? Just because somebody's in the stands don't mean they're on anybody's team except for the game. Oh, I put a Patriots shirt on. They're not going to be with you next season. They're broke. They can't buy a seat again. If a guy is with you and they're broke, they're on drugs, they're cheating, they're screwing around, they're going to strip joints, they're not even on a team. They go wherever. They're spectators. They're on team free-for-all. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> they're on team whatever's hot this week. I'm going to do it. That's not a team player. That's not who you want in your empire. Talk to me about the empire, champ. Yeah. Growing the empire, you got to have your purpose. you got to have it strong enough yeah. so that you're bigger than everyday life. So you when know, I partner create, up with somebody. Creating greatness. Yeah. When I partner up with somebody, I'm like, that guy will throw down for me. Or he's a partner that won't throw down with me. Then I know what he is. 
He won't throw down for himself right now. He won't throw down for the team right now. Then he's just kind of a partner. So maybe I give that relationship less attention right now and that partnership less attention because I can only grow it so much if he's not all in, right? Commit to defending the people on your team at all costs, no matter what it takes, how many scars you need to get. Three, defend at all costs. Shut it down right from the get-go. Stop it. Knock it off. I don't want to hear that from you. Okay, don't talk like that. Most people get their information from a tabloid magazine. That's a shame. That's a darn shame. Okay, next caller. We got Jordan. Jordan. What's up, Jordan? Jordan. How are you? Come on, Jordan. Thanks for calling in. All right, I call. I messaged you earlier, um, this e- or yesterday evening, as, asking questions about my husband and where I should stand in his path to success. Mm. Where what? Wow. what? Where, where should she stand in his path to success? Mm. So I feel like I'm bringing him down with like ne- the negativity, but he has um, done the, this type of work before, and he's felt at it each time. Yeah. So it's kind of hard to be that support and not be negative at the same time. Yeah, dude, this is a great call, that by the way. We've never call. had this call. This is an awesome call. And she's being really honest. Like, she's like, I'm bringing him down, but look, he's failed a bunch. She should see the movie, the Ray Kroc movie. What's it called? Yeah, yeah, the Ray Kroc movie, uh, McDonald's with Michael Keaton. Mm, it's a Came one out word. Recently. It's one word. Um, anyway. Founder. Founder. It's called Founder. Yeah. Bing, 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 bing. I get the Founder, trick for the day. So look, look, this is what I would tell you, okay? Yeah. First of all, I mean, I can totally relate because my, my mom and my sisters and my twin brother, they watch me, do they watch me do so many things that I fail that unbelievable number of things. Everything they watch me do from 16 to probably 28, they watch me fail at. Everything, and, and I'd go into these things all passionate, like, let's go, right? And then, boom, it, it flopped. And we still go through that, where we're about to have a big deal about something, yeah, yeah, and then yeah, it falls yeah, short. Yeah. I mean, we, and even yeah, in our lives and, now, we have yeah, yeah. a tremendous setbacks. amount of, sh- yes, setbacks. setbacks and, 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 and discouragements, and like, I, I go into everything today. Nobody knows this, but I go look at, I, I, I think I'm gonna go do a thing. You have no idea how much of me is skeptical to, to I'm not going to be able to make this happen. To the plane, to the real estate, to the business, to Grant Cardone TV studios, to the TV thing that we've been working on for years. But notice you didn't say me. No, never her. See? Okay, I like so, that. So the, 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 point, the point I'm making is, you're, I promise you, your husband, whatever amount of skepticism you have about him, he's got 10 times that much. That's what you don't know. He's torturing himself every day. He's got so much fuel burning on his lack of belief in himself, that he probably tries to over I know we're going to make it this time, right? He's got to tell himself that to stay in the game. Man, whatever you could do to just say, you know what? We're in Maybe. it to win it like eyes of men. This, this is going to be the one. This is going to be the one. And by the way, if it's not, then the next one's got a better chance. You know, yeah, I know it's exactly. hard. Look, I know it's risky, but the reality is it's risky if you guys don't go for it. You know what I'm saying? Yes. So, so, and I, I know it can be painful when you're watching a guy fail. Mm. Mm-hmm. But not it as pain, exactly not, not as painful it is as it is to him. I promise you. I agree. It's just it really is just something I'm kind of trying to talk him out of any deal that he's going for and try to get him to do something else that we're guaranteed money. We're guaranteed that our bills will be paid when they need to be paid and not just, you know, going off of maybe he will be able to pay it or maybe he won't. Yeah. But baby, you, you, like, you're not guaranteed anything anyway. Right. So yeah. th- this is what you know, you're 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 thinking is what bills and keeps in place the middle class in, in this country, okay? I'm not talking about the middle class in income bracket, I'm talking about the middle class that think, play it safe, play it safe. Yeah, you know. Mm-hmm. But your mom and dad, your mom and dad, that's the game your mom and dad played. So you think that I should just continue supporting him and not give him like the reality of it? I think, I, being- I think you should give him the reality. Go give me some money today, son. <laughs> You bring some money home today. I, you can do anything. You can fly. You can freaking, you can def- You can go to Mars. Bring me some freaking money today because we got to go to Whole Foods for these kids. 
So, you know, Elena, Elena, I come home, I said I had a bad day. One day I told her, I said, I man, I had a terrible day today. She's like, what, what are you doing home then? Why don't you go back to the office until it's a good day and then bring that home to me? So, so look, you can keep, you can keep it big. You know, you can keep the big, oh, let's do it. Let's do something big. Bring me some money today. So stay in the physical universe, folks. Everybody, everybody, your, your husband should stay in the physical universe. Give me something today. Build that big picture later. I'm going to go buy 10,000 apartments, okay? I got 4,000 I got to take care of right now. Right now. When I was selling cars, I'm going to build an apartment portfolio. I had to sell a Corolla today before I could build the big picture out. You and that's, get it? What her, that's the point she was saying. Yeah. Like, should she just keep supporting this pie in the sky, not real right now? Bring me some, buy me some groceries today. Pay the rent today, right? Go give me some money today. You want to do something big? Go on that street corner and give me 50 bucks right now. Go and then dream as big as you want the rest of the time, okay? I hope that helps. Hey, my name's Grant Cardone. This is Elena Cardone every yeah. Wednesday. Yeah, and, and I would just say um, to Jordan, right? Yeah. Um, you know, if y'all are really on the same page, you know, is there anything you can do? Like some something, mm. sell Avon products, whatever, anything, anything to bring in a little extra income to, to help y'all, you know? I wouldn't worry about that. I'd tell him, go, go get me some money, son. I like the way you think you're old school. Go get me some money, man. You don't need to do any more work. He's the one that wants to dream big. Good, good. You want to dream big? Good. You want to go to Mars? Go get me some money, bud. Go get me some. If you can go and to Mars, if you can think Mars that big, shit, all I'm asking you to do is get 500 bucks. Just flip the thing on him, man. Fuel him and say, hey, good. You want to go do blah, blah? You want to become a freaking black diamond in, front, in whatever the network market? Good. Go get me 500 bucks today. You want to be the next Walt Disney? You want to do Google? Good. I had a guy in my office today, man. He's like, he wants to do 3D and virtual and virtual, virtual reality. I'm like, that's great, bro. Go give me a thousand bucks today. Because if you can't go get a thousand dollars today in a real world, how are you going to go sell VR to Google? Let's keep it real. Let's keep it real. You guys, y'all, y'all worry about the wrong stuff, man. Y'all worry about the wrong stuff. Now, one thing I will tell you is you guys need to defend one another. Who's on your team, man? Where y'all going? Yeah, that's what you could tell Jordan. You know, if yeah. somebody comes to her and says, what do you, why do you think your husband or your boyfriend's going to make it this time? He fails at everything. That poor soul. That's yeah. when she, no matter if she even feels like that, and those are the discuss discussions they're having behind closed crack doors. Crack your mommy in the head. To their face, you better say, shut it down. I'm going to crack Knock your face. Knock it off. I'm going to crack your face wide open. That's right. I crack Commit, your face wide defend. open. Defend. Okay. Crack them. Crack them. Crack mom, dad, uncle, aunt. That's what y'all get most of your bad information. Crack them in the head, man. Okay. You didn't marry your mama. You didn't marry your daddy. You married your husband, man. Defend him at all costs or divorce him. Ooh. If you can't defend him, get rid of him. And then you might want to look at who you're Because you're killing him anyway. You're killing him anyway. And just, you're killing just yourself. Just make it official. You're killing yourself. I was with this girl for a long time. She, she just couldn't defend me. You always want to do all this big stuff. Good, go away. You got to go. Okay, so you guys got to fight for your own dreams, man. Fight for your own dreams. You can't fight for yourself. You're certainly not going to fight for her. So I'm fighting for her. Defend the ones you love. Decide on who's on your team. Commit to defending them and then defend them at all costs. I hey, like look, that. if you like, like the that. show, if you like the show, hit like. If you don't like the show, hit dislike. Shit, I love that. Commit to something. But comment. Am I right? Am I wrong? Is she right? Is she wrong? How good does she look? Aw, huh? thank you. And look, if you got an idea about a topic you'd like us to cover in the g and &E show, The Business of Being Married, How to Build Your Empire, post it in comments. We love your comments. We appreciate you showing up today. We appreciate you being here. Oh, if yeah, you want a do. free ticket oh. to the 10X Growth Con, go to 10xgrowthcon.com. I'm giving free tickets away today. Just a few things you got to do to get a free ticket, but I want to get you wait, a free ticket. Wait. I'm throwing them around, Wait, man. wait, whoa, I have whoa. gloves. Scrap I have gloves. Screen. Here, okay. put and we this got some... silicone glove on. Who, who sent okay. me this? Okay, this, this is from Marty Kate, K-H-A-I-T, Marty Dude, Kate. These are perfect with my shoes. Oh, man. man. These are okay, perfect with here. my shoes, man. Okay. 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 Here okay. you go. Here you go. You hey, got your silicone you guys, gloves. Man, <laughs> and if you, guys, if you guys could get me a screenshot and throw this on my Instagram... Okay. I mean, this is good, man. Huh? 
What? Oh, yeah, with your knife? Yeah, 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 yeah. Wait. If you guys can get a screenshot of this on Instagram, that'd be funny, man. I'll follow you back, all right? Give me a screenshot. I don't know how to get your knife out. Tag me, tag me. Grant Cardone, okay? And my SWAT. That's good. That's good. That's great. That's kind of strange. <laughs> a little strange. Okay, on the anything else, babe? What else you no, got? No, that's it. Thank you so much for joining. Tomorrow, Young Hustlers. Friday's what? Cardone Zone. Friday's the Cardone Woo Zone, man. Look, look, look. If you guys want a free ticket, get a free Woo ticket. If you want my book, Millionaire Booklet, go to MillionaireBooklet.com. Go to the MillionaireBooklet.com. That motherfucker hot. It's so hot, I got to wear silicone glove. MillionaireBooklet.com forward slash free. <laughs> The g &E Show is also available for download on iTunes and Stitcher. See the link in the description below. Too many people are being kept from their dreams by circumstances they couldn't control and mistakes from a long time ago. All they needed was a second chance or a fresh start. That's why Cash Now was created. Since 1997, Ray Abood, owner of Cash Now, has been the premier expert in home renovation and resale in the York Tri-State area. Dedicated to premier customer service, getting the best deals at the lowest price, this is the only expert company you should deal with when it comes to buying and selling a home. Offering a five-step home buying process, Ray and his team will ensure your needs are covered and get you closer to your dreams of buying a home in any city across the United States. To find out more on how you can get started on owning or selling a home, visit CashNowPA.com. That's CashNowPA.com to get started.